Greetings, gamers, streamers, and off-worlders. I'm CMAPT, and welcome to my channel. Um, so, it got like below 30 last night, and I'm super cold, so I'm like super dressed for the occasion, even though it's like now about 70 degrees in my room, but like, I get cold really easily. I hope you guys had a good weekend, and I hope you have something warm to drink. I just had some soup, um, and stay warm. So last time we left off the main story with this giant rock in Vivek, like dooming all of Vivek and just like filling the sky and like falling rocks everywhere. So um, I don't know if Vivek is, is dead or he's like half dead or something, but um, so apparently Azura can kind of help. Not quite sure what's going on exactly. I kind of like freaked out because I wasn't sure what was going on. And then like I had to leave. <laughs> I had to finish it, finish the stream. So like I kind of, I kind of like rushed through it. And I think it's going to put us back to the beginning of the conversation with Azura. So we'll have to go back and um, talk to her. and kind of like restart it a little bit. But, um, yeah, I was a little overwhelmed last time, but I'm chilled out now. I've had time to think about it. So we're gonna finish that. We're just gonna do main story, see where it takes us. And I'm dressed like, oh my gosh, that guy was quick. Outlander, over here. Right. I've been trying to find something that makes sense of all. <laughs> so we're gonna go through this again. Mortal, Mortal the, lady the Lady of Twilight, of Twilight has words for, for you. you. So Vivette deigns to ask for help. I foresaw such an event, but scarcely believed it. Listen well, for if you continue to perform flawlessly, we might yet thwart the efforts of Clavicus Vile and his hound. Hmm. Lord Vivek said that, um, to ask you for guidance in this matter. Click. Just as I anticipated, the mysteries reveal that Barbas seeks to enter the Clockwork City. So far, so the sealed wards have impeded him, but the Hound has Sunra. You must beat him to the prize, the reservoir that holds Vivek's stolen energy. Clockwork City? Such knowledge has been hidden even from me, mortal. But I know someone who can provide you with the means to travel to Sotha Seal's creation. Stand back, and I shall summon the Mage of Cogs and Gears. Interesting. That shouldn't have happened. Now, where in oblivion am I? Mage, this, this mortal, mortal speaks, speaks with the authority, authority of, of the mother's soul. Hmm. Interesting. Summoned by a Daedric prince and her mortal mouthpiece. I was right in the middle of a crucial experiment. But I suppose I can spare a few clicks of the cogs for Azura and my erstwhile assistant. So, did you break the tonal inverter? Mm, nope, it works fine. Azura wants you to help me get to the Quackwick City. No, not going to happen. Oh. No offense to the Lady of Twilight, but Soph the Seal was quite adamant about keeping the place hidden and warded against the Daedra. Wait, pistons fall into place. This concerns Sunara and Lord Vivek, I presume? Yes, Barbus tricked us into draining Lord Vivek's divine energy. Barbus, another Daedra? Barbus. Thinking, thinking. So... So the seal's forgotten tools modified to steal Vivek's energy, which in turn energized the Clockwork City. Lit it up like the top of Red Mountain. Even Vile's dog would be able to see that. Can you get me there or not? What is Barbus after? Just think Wait. about it. Gears click into place. Mm. The reservoir. 
You need to reach the reservoir that contains Vivek's stolen energy before Barbas. I can get us to the entrance in Set's vault beneath the Mournhold Temple. Ready to go? Mm-hmm. Let's go. You'll need my help. I know the city almost as well as so the seal. Follow me. Mm -hmm. Cool. Now I'm like starting to get really pumped up. Had a little bit of breakfast. I burned my soup this morning. I look like I need to go to Tatooine. All nice and wastelanded out. Okay. I think the hound used Sonora to get inside. We have to hurry. Hmm. Daedra, vile creatures of chaos. Deal with them, please. <laughs> Deal with them. Where exactly are we going? That way? Let's deal. deal with all of them? No, wait. Let's... What do we got? How many of these can I stack? Let's find out. I guess only one food item. in such a sacred place. It's so I wreck and barely calculate our odds of survival. We need to deal with Barbas's minions. And by we, I definitely mean you. I'm a thinker, not a fighter. Forgot to factor mm. in the presence of Sunara. Between the connection to Sofa Seal and the amount of Vivek's energy flowing through it, the Hound could use the staff to trick the entryway's guardians. I'll have a tougher time once inside, though. Hmm. But the Scoffin can't get inside? It depends on how smart the Hound really is. With the staff, he can do what he came to do. Manipulate the city's defenses. Looks like he called in Scoffin to deal with Zoe the Seal's fabricants. Poor little mechanicals are no match for Daedra. Alright. I, if I gotta take care of them all... Yeah. You gonna follow me? What you doing? Come on! Forgot to fuck. Still don't trust me after all. After I had Let's go. No? Alright. Fine, I'm going without you. Wait, this scarf and agitated one of the guardians. <laughs> oh, Brought me to my knees.
something to slow him down. Yeah. Woo! That's kind of a close call. I don't know. Well, I guess we'll see. Hmm. That's my quick slot. in myself to complete this is getting slim. I don't like being slowed down. coins, all right? That's Clockwork City. It's so small. Precisely. Oh, I see your concern. God, you haven't been here before. Use the entrance and push it down and get drawn inside. I understand that some of Sophie's first entrance had unintended effects. But now it's a better mm -hmm. reset. Okay, why is it in the globe? Besides, once we get inside, it's much bigger than it looks. My former master said that working in miniature. In we go. Hope I don't die. What happens to one when they die in a small miniature Black Orc city? What? It energy. It, it flows through Sonora. That's how Barbas is able to circumvent the city's defenses. Why is he waiting over there? I'll never understand what motivates these Daedra. Did we shrink into the miniature city? Yes. Thanks to Sophie the Seal of Magic, my former master is exceedingly brilliant. I thought you already knew that. Anyway, there's no way we'd fit in here at our normal size. So the magic altered us as we passed through the doorway. Hmm. If Barbus can use Vivek's energy, do we really stand a chance against him? Always a chance. It just depends upon the way the gears align. <clears throat> 
I like him. He can spare too much to you He's positive. Person. He needs it to reach the reservoir and do whatever Clavicus Vile sent him to do. Now, I really think we need to get moving. <laughs> Oh, my favorite dupe has finally arrived! <laughs> you will talk to the Daedric Dog if you want, and follow me into the maintenance junction. Hmm. should take care of the defenses. Mm -hmm. I disabled most of the defenses in this section. Silver Seal installed numerous safeguards. I advise caution just in case. Barbus is ahead of us, but I know many paths through the city. Just like the fox that chased the hound. Who's who? With my help, the probability calculates in your favor. But you must keep moving. The hound won't draw. Unless he comes upon an interesting smell. Or a tree. Since we know Barbus's ultimate destination. I can open rooms he can't access. Oh, well, that's gonna help us. Wait. Thank you. Thank you. You said you disabled the defenses? Most of them. Oh, good. Might be a random contraption or a wandering factotum still out there. And if Barbara smuggles in more data, the other defenses will become active. Where's he going? In one logical place. To the atelier where Sotha Seal conducted his study of divine energy. Sooner I would have sent the stolen power there. It's not far. What Barbus and his master want with Vivex energy, though, remains unclear. Yeah, go. I hope I don't die. Pretty hard for me because they like made me stop every. Oh my goodness! Okay. Oh dang it! We did the two things. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Oh, <laughs> I just walked through. All done. Watch run. <clears throat> okay. No one ever catches the hound. You can use these controls. Follow Barbus. Follow Barbus. You are persistent. I'll give you that. Looks like you need more scoffing. 
Oh, uh, this one's really hard. Ah! Uh, it keeps stopping me. I don't want to die here. I need to get rid of the person who keeps. Okay, is that was that it? Uh. So close. I'm just getting by with these guys. How's my armor looking? Hello? Armor? What? I can't do anything with... Oops. My armor is looking fine. Okay. Okay, Barbus went that way. Man. Man. I think this is the one that keeps making me stop so much. Oh wait, or is it this one? Much for defense right there. What are yeah, you? Hi! You wanna be friends? Be relentless. Be relentless, the teal. Be relentless! You can do it! You can do it! You can survive. You're a survivor, the teal. Okay, well, at least you didn't slow me down. Ah! Okay. I thought that was going to be a lot scarier. Toy has me, you annoying creature. This way. Yeah. Master, I'm close to our goal. With the Vex energy, I can open a portal and. Pray this works, my Sounds like the master is completely happy with his dog. This engineering junction contains some of Sotha Seal's most powerful fabricants. They'll take care of the scoffing, but they might also try and deal with us. Was Barbus actually talking to Calavicus Vile? It certainly sounded that way. The Hound said something about using Vivek's energy to open a portal. Why would he... Oh no! That much power could punch a hole through all of Sothasil's defenses, allowing Calavicus Vile to enter the city. That would be bad. That would be catastrophic! Imagine a Daedric Prince with access to Sothasil's greatest invention knows what damage he could do with the power of the clockwork city at his command. We have to keep going. We have to stop Barbus. Okay. Hey. This one. Close, Master. 
secrets of Sofa Cell City will be yours. Get on with it, dog. Grant me access to the Clockwork City, oh! and I'll reward you a thousand. Why wasn't I running? Points. Oh my gosh, all of you? Master, why do you bother with partners when you have such a faithful servant in me? When you're finished with those fabricants, follow me. Questioning me, Barbus? Again? Have you learned nothing from your last banishment? Beautiful, isn't it? One of Sotha Seal's favorite atelier. I think Barbus is already inside. That's the atelier behind me. Not only is this the workshop where Sotha Seal experimented with divine energy, it also has is one of the reservoirs that can be used to power the entire city. Mm. A reservoir currently filled with Vivex energy. And Barbus is in there? Almost certainly. Sunara led him right to it. It won't take the Hound long to figure out how to access Vivex stolen energy. Then he'll try to open a portal for his master, Clavicus Vile. Can Barbus actually use Vivex energy to open a portal? Maybe. Probably. It's a distinct possibility. Certainly the Hound and his master think so. Whether it will actually work or not, you have to go in there and stop him. The danger's too great to ignore. Hmm. Let's go stop Barbus. No, no, that's inadvisable. The Atelier has defenses. You have no idea what it will do if it marks one of Sotha Seal's apprentices as an enemy. Neither do I. You go. I'll use the controls over there and help you from out here. All right, I'm going in. Okay. All right, let me check one thing. Do do do. Some reason my buttons aren't working. Let me check my hotkeys real quick. Weird. Oh, probably why. Do do do. Hmm. Checking something on my overlay real quick. Play, color, media. Great. My, like, hotkeys for my chat aren't working for some reason, so I'm gonna have to go fix that later. I had such a problem with my headphones today. You can't stop me if the defenses won't let you in. It looks like we're gonna have to fight this. Dang. <laughs> okay. Ultimate charged up. Yeah. Open out the place where I might die. But yeah, I had a hard time getting my headphones to work like 30 minutes before streaming. And it actually took me about like that whole 30 minutes to try to figure out why it wasn't hooking up. Very frustrating. Ah!
There, was there a, a way shrine in here? Did I... I don't know, I can try again. I can give it a shot. One more lime. Let's eat this. Hmm. I don't know. I might die again. I don't know what to do if I do die again. Here we go! Uh, we can't do that again. I'm just gonna die again. How many times do you want me to go through this? You really should get back in there and deal with- So, I don't need your sass. Um, I need a different strategy. I don't know if I have anything that can really help me in this situation. I think I'm kind of shit out of options. from it because it just keeps pulling me in.
Oh, I'm not sure. Maybe something will come out of it. They don't have... some things. you. Instead of the sweep, though, I do want the Nova. Or the, whatever, solar prison. Okay, we can try again. Wait, what the heck happened? Oh, I know what happened. Oh, this isn't gonna go well at all. Already, this is off to a bad start. working. heal myself and then like slash my sword every now and then okay yeah fuck you oh. that was a surprise cool please not another one oh um, Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Hmm. So those things are probably gonna attack me. Thinking. I guess we'll have to wait and see how that works. I guess it depends on how much damage they do. Maybe I should just focus on that guy. Just 
go for the healing again, I guess. But let's try this little theory first. Heal him. That's not gonna be helpful at all. Okay. magic. and destroy its defenses. Let me guess, another one? like it. What secrets do you have? I guess we won't know until we try. I just hope I don't have to redo all of these when I die. again.
hatch is active. Open it and enter the energy reservoir. I guess I wasn't supposed to keep hammering on the little spider things. They apparently were a distraction. Fluctuations ahead. Barbus is manipulating the energy reservoir. Hurry! All right, are you guys ready? Because I'm not. Like my new armor? No. I wear something special when I kill you. No. Get him! Get him, Dio! Get him! Get him with all you have. On of him! Get him! Don't let him get the best of you. You can do it, Detail. Don't let him intimidate you. Don't let him intimidate you. Hi! Oh, sweet. It looks like I can use my bottles again. It though. Avoid, avoid these little things. Avoid being hit by these things. Take that. Strategy, strategy. Get over here. Get over here. Avoid the things, avoid the things, avoid the things. Oh, no, no, no! You did not avoid the things like I told you to! Okay, get him! Get him, Detail! Get him! Oh, you little... You little... Uh... Get him to heal. 
You can do it. Get him. Get him to two. You can do it. energy from the reservoir conduit. Lots of interference. Makes it difficult to lock onto a destination. I'll go ahead to stabilize the connection. Such a good and faithful hound. You have done enough for now. But we didn't give up and we believed in ourselves. So, you're the mortal who gave my poor dog so much trouble. I suppose we should have a chat, you and I. Mm. <laughs> Hello? Up here? Should, should we have a chat? Oh, I see you. Is this some kind of glitch? chat I'm gonna need uh, the option to chat with you okay there it is how dare you discipline my dog he was only trying to appease his master and I'd never harm a hair on whatever insignificant creature you hold dear you on the other hand require a lesson in manners Barbus tried to kill Lord Vivek and destroy Vardenfell indeed what ambition as you can see Barbus isn't a bad dog he does get easily excited and overzealous. He embellished my plans somewhat, but it all worked out in the end. And we found the Clockwork City. So you were trying to take control of the Clockwork City? This little flea thinks it's smart, but my plans are beyond its comprehension. Still, by delaying the inevitable, you caused my associates and I some trouble. You will stay here until you're no longer a threat. How does a few decades sound to you? <laughs> no thanks, I think I'll find my own way out. Let's go. Quiet dog! Haven't you? Wait, who dares intrude upon my lesson? Found you. Over here. Oh, Clavicus Vile. This isn't good. I lost you somewhere between the Clockwork City and Vivek. It was simple enough to trace your energy signature to this Daedric shrine. Unfortunately, some power is interfering with my efforts to open a portal for you. It's Clavicus. He wants to trap me here for a few decades. Oh, that would be unfortunate for you. Luckily, you have me to assist you. Well, me and Sonora. Expend a small amount of Vivek's energy at the statue, and that should provide enough of a distraction for me to pull you out of there. All right. Be gone, meddling wizard! Whoa. Was it too much? I got through all of those bosses, oh my gosh! <laughs> well, glad to see you're still alive, assistant. Hurry, Outlander. The Vec is nearly spent. Hey, I'm here to save the day. My time draws to a close. Were you successful? Can you restore my energy? Mm. At the staff, the last time it nearly killed you. So you retrieved my stolen energy. You stopped Barbus. 
Now, return what is rightfully mine. Hmm. How can I be certain the staff won't harm you again? To quote my 75th exaltation, certainty is the brother of fear. Nothing is certain. But I have confidence in you. In what you have done. Use the staff. Turn my energy. Or not. In a little while. It won't matter. I'll use the staff. Oh, soon enough. And restore my energy. Praise Vivek, his energy is restored. Remarkable. No ordinator or armager could have done any better. You uncovered a Daedric spy in our midst, brought a living god back from the brink of death, and saved all of Vardenfell. Well done, my friend. It was nothing. As my next sermon shall proclaim, modesty is the false cloak of a flatterer, or the sincere garment of the humble. Again, you have my gratitude, and that of all my people. Indeed, even those who rail against the tribunal owe you their lives. Apparently, it's not that much, because I only get 196 gold. I feel like I should get more for all of that. Did you see those, like, mechanical monsters? I almost- I died! I died twice. You have done much for me and for Vardenfell. You As almost died, says, Vivek. I died twice. Do not think the battle is over when the enemy is dead. The hearts and minds of the people must also be won. I must ask you for one more service. Oh, what do you need me to do? Gratitude is its own reward, I once told the crowds in Ebenhar. But I found that some of my followers appreciate something more tangible. Help me reward those who aided in the saving of Vardenfell, so we can reassure my people. How can I help you reward people? To start, retrieve the Archcanon's signet from the Hall of Wisdom. It is time to appoint a new head priest. I shall gather my people and meet you at my statue on the central canton. It oh, shall be right. a glorious ceremony, my friend. I'll meet you there. Okay, so what about the giant rock in the sky? Is that taken care of yet? Uh, who knew what we were getting into when we met my ancestral tomb, eh, my friend? I'm just sorry that poor Archcanon Tarvis is no longer with us. I mean the real one, not the Daedric Hound. He really was a good man, and an excellent priest. Okay, but for real, The Rock? I've been away from my tower for much too long. Alright, you get back to your little tower. There you need to save my people and the land itself. Okay. Alright, well let's go outside see if that giant rock is still there. Doesn't sound like it. I guess it just magically disappeared when Vivek got better. Oh, no, it's still there. It's just, it's just a big rock in the sky. Nothing weird about that. I find that weird though, maybe, maybe that's just me. But at least it's a nice day. Go get this signet. Oh, look at that. No, like that little rock right there. It kinda reminds me of like a Himalayan salt rock. Okay. I just want to look at this. Yeah. That strange mirror. The signet. The journal. Okay. Go back to Vivek. Talk to Vivek. Is he over there now? Rejoice. 
You cursed the darkness with good reason. Now praise the return of the light. Why is he out here? The eyes and ears of the warrior poet returns. And just in time for the gathering crowd. Were you able to locate the arch cannon's signal? Yes. Continue to guard it. For it represents not only my loyal servant Tarvis, but also the past and future of my priesthood. And take this as well, to aid you in your next task. What's in the bag? You have been my eyes and ears in the world. Now be my hands. Within the modest sack resides gifts for my faithful servants. Blessings from me, though I would have you deliver them. You served me in adversity. Now join me in celebration. What do you want me to do? As I call forth my faithful, reach into the sack and give them the first thing you find. They shall hear my words of praise and gratitude, while it shall be your hand that rewards them. Are you ready, friend of the vet? Overseer Shirelas, step forth. Overseer Shirelas. You sacrificed your blessing stones to aid the warrior poet. Well done. Take these recharged stones and finish building my city. After relaxing with your patient wife. Thank you, Lord Vivek. I shall do as you ask. Battles up. Approach. Your knowledge of the mysteries of my brother Sotha Seal and the intricate twists and turns of portal magic were invaluable. Take this and use it well to further your experiments. Yeah, there you go. Here. Gemstones filled with a tiny fraction of divine energy. Amazing and so very generous. With careful tuning, this could improve portal magic a hundredfold. Thank you. Canon Levul, kneel before me. Was that? Did Lord Vivek summon me? Arch Canon Tarvis served us well until his death. But when I was most in need of assistance, Canon Levul rose to the occasion. Now rise once more as Arch Canon Levul. Aw, look at you. Congratulations there, buddy. My lord. I'm not worthy, but I shall endeavor to become so. Thank you, and I can't Good wait words. to inform my ancestors. In every poem, it's the last stanza that holds the most meaning. Once a stranger to our land, now a friend forever. Step forward. Oh, who, me? You come before me with an empty sack. But have no fear. As I have written, treat your enemies well and your friends even better. Know that I consider you to be a very good friend. Oh. Will you accept the honor I am about to bestow upon you? Yes. Then let it be known that from this moment forth, you shall be called the Champion of Vivek. And along with my thanks, take this modest reward. I foresee even greater achievements in your future. Mm -hmm. But for now, be content to be the hero of Morrowind. Yay! Now go forth and rejoice. Yay! Yay! Those monsters were hard. And I thought I was gonna die, and I thought I was gonna give up, but I didn't give up. I'm the best! You saved Lord Vivek and saved Vivek City. Ooh. Cool. <laughs> Champion of Vivek. Got buoyant armager body tattoos. That active? From neck to ankle. Well, can't really see that then. Whatever. 
Oh wait, we got the buoyant armager face tattoo. Looks like somebody burned her with mercury or something. We'll keep the Morog Tong on there. Cute. Oh, not bad. I like heavy armor. Well, we did the thing and we're kind of like at a stopping point right now. So I think I'm gonna just wrap it up. Like that was kind of tough for me. I need to like kind of sit on this and uh, just kind of meditate like he's doing because like that was kind of a big deal for me. I need to I need to take a break. Um, so we we saved Vivek and we saved Lord Vivek and everything seems to be well and good. I don't see anything happening with any main quest at the moment. So we're gonna like take a break right here and it's been about an hour so this is a good stopping sp spot until next time and then we'll like finish what we were doing with Veya because there's a little bit left of that quest that we need to do so we're gonna like jump on that and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day and night live long and prosper I'm gonna go make some onigiri I'm definitely ready for some onigiri